after playing a couple of hours of Lost Ark and live streaming my adventure with the Outcast community, and there's one thing that immediately popped in my head during my playthrough on stream and off stream. Is Lost Ark the Diablo MMO? For those of you who do not know this genre of gaming, I'll give you a brief explanation. So titles like the Diablo series, Torchlight series, and even Path of Exiles, and many more, will follow along in the ARPG category, or more known as Action RPG. With Diablo and the mini titles being a subcategory of an ARPG, referring to dungeon crawling or looter RPGs, and then following the fact in which heroes navigate a labyrinth environment or a dungeon, battling various monsters, avoiding traps, solving puzzles, and looting any treasure they may find. Fine. Now that we have a better understanding of the genre and some dominant forces in their respective category, which leads me to the Korean MMO Lost Ark and developed by Smilegate, and Diablo, the looter RPG that is praised by many and loved by all that's developed by Blizzard. Lost Ark has been running the scene since its first release date on December 4th, 2019 quickly rose to the top in popularity and so much so the western players desperately needed a taste of this new ARPG MMO. Some decided to even use VPN to change their regions to play Lost Dark and completely attempting the game in Korean. But finally as of this year a month back our first closed beta test finally getting a taste of this awesome MMO recently thanks to the partnership between Amazon Game Studios and Smilegate to allow the game to have a rest and release fully English. Diablo and Lost Ark is pretty similar in a lot of ways, sharing the same camera style, save movements and skills to help players along their path through the game, the whole core structure of the game feels remotely the same. During my initial playthrough I've expressed many times Lost Ark felt so much like Diablo 3, in particular just on more of a broader spectrum. Anyone who is quite familiar with the Diablo series will feel like home playing Lost Ark. The awesome classes to run through, the intriguing storyline to indulge yourself, and of course playing with other players to go through dungeons and raids. Lost Ark has some of the best combat to offer to players as its structure like the ARPGs I previously mentioned. This is somewhat of a healthy blend of great combat and still make the world feel full like it's an MMO. Which makes Diablo one of the more iconic and one of the best of the genre in the looter RPGs. But it never became an MMO and that's where Lost Ark comes into play. One of my favorite things to enjoy seeing during my playthrough is the crowd of enemies rushing you down and you know it's go time and it's time for battle and it gives you that action players crave so much. My final thoughts on is Lost Ark the Diablo MMORPG is yes, in a way. They both share a lot of similarities and the combat and overall gameplay feels the same. Of course, both titles have much differences which makes them unique in their own way and with the dark gruesome world of Diablo focusing on the war between heaven and hell and the bright vibrant cartoonish world of Lost Ark focusing on finding the Lost Ark, no pun intended. Each class in both games are all unique and fun to play as and the plentiful of dungeons that are full in a MMO and with all the content in Diablo 3. With the constant dungeon rating, they both have a great potential to get players to spend lots of hours and time into the games. And now I do want to point out, I do not mean Smilegate is trying to take over or even copy Diablo or Blizzard, or any of that, just more so saying that the cartoonish vibrant game of Lost Ark just feels so similar to Diablo. It feels like I am playing one of my favorite games that I used to play with when I was younger, a couple years back, definitely grinding throughout Diablo 3, and even further back when I used to play Diablo 2. Which leads me to ask the community, do you think Lost Ark is a Diablo MMO? If so, then tell me why in the comment section below. I would love to talk to the Outcast community about this topic, so if you have any questions, feel free to ask. If you enjoyed the topic on today's episode, definitely hit the like button so the video can be shown to others, and subscribe to the channel. I cover everything RPG related as well as tech videos focused for gamers. And as always, it's been your host, KSDTV, signing out.
Peace. Rapping for clout, I know the fame is empty, and this a dangerous perk. It make a hater friendly, but if the shine come with an opportunity, it's whatever. I'ma win, gotta do what I gotta do. And the ambition open doors, so I'm gon' stop. Already know I'm the man, don't need no props. The ambition that I got make the hoes watch. Ambition open doors, breaking those locks. If ambition open doors, so I'm gon' quit. I fell in love with the money, fuck my old bitch. 